Hi, I'm Alana Albert. I play on the Williams women's soccer team. I'm a physics and philosophy double major, and you're watching Eve Spotlight. <laughs> So I chose Williams because of the small class sizes, because I really wanted to make sure that I could engage with the material and have conversation be a large part of my classroom experience. And then I also chose Williams because of the soccer team and the team environment that I saw here during my clinics and team visits and stuff like that. And also just the style of play that Williams plays is um, really beautiful, I think, and we really work on uh, quick, sharp passes and things like that, and then also just how beautiful the area is. So some team rituals that we have are before games, we have sort of like a dance party in the locker room where we have uh, choreographed dances and we do them all together as a team. And then also during our pregame practices, um, which are on Fridays, we always have a minute to win it activity at the end, which can be something as silly as like taking an Oreo, putting it on your forehead and trying to like get it down to your mouth without touching it with your hands. So my favorite memory um, of my team at Williams is when we were getting ready for our national final my sophomore year, we were playing Middlebury and our whole team was huddled around in the locker room together before going out into the field. And you could just see the emotion on everybody's face because we knew no matter what, this was our last game together as that specific team. Um, and so it was really emotional, but like a really great time because we were just so thankful for what we had created that season. And then we went out and beat Middlebury in the national final. So that's always awesome. So outside of soccer and academics at Williams, I'm a tour guide and I'm also a part of the women's and gender minorities um, in physics and astronomy group. And I was also a junior advisor my uh, junior year and I'm also a te uh, teacher's assistant or a TA for physics courses. So as a junior advisor, a JA, I was one of four juniors that decided to live with a group of about uh, 40 to 50 freshmen um, during their entire freshman year. And so that's a really great time to watch freshmen grow throughout their um, first year at Williams and just watch them make Williams their own. And one of my favorite memories is for the first week, the JAs are responsible for making snacks for the entry. And uh, my co's and I were trying to make um, brownies, but we ended up not really knowing how to use the oven. So our brownies were basically just soup, but the whole entry got together and ate it with spoons and it was a really fun time. <laughs> So my sophomore spring, I decided to do some research with one of my physics professors. I've continued with her um, throughout my entire time here. I'm now doing a thesis with her during my senior year. Um, I had never had any lab experience before that, and I thought it was a really interesting way to know what uh, being, was, being a physicist was outside of just learning in the classroom. Um, and it's been a really great experience. I didn't need any lab experience before that, um, and it's just been a great way to sort of see a new side of physics beyond just doing problem sets and learning in class. So next year, my plans, um, I'm a, applying for grad school right now for physics. I really hope to be a physics professor one day at a place like Williams where I get to have one-on-one -on -one interactions with students all the time. Um, and then I'm also definitely looking for another place to play soccer considering my senior year got cut short a little different in terms of my soccer career than I would have liked. Um, so hopefully I can find a women's league or something that's pretty competitive. Um, and then also obviously coming back here fully dressed in a cow suit to watch my teammates tear it up on the field next year. So something that I'm going to miss about Williams next year is just living with some of my closest friends. Um, and those include my teammates and other people that aren't on the soccer team, but I've still created some really close relationships with over these past three years. Um, and I'm definitely going to miss uh, playing in games, something that I miss already now, um, and just being able to really let my competitive side loose and win a lot of stuff. I'm always going to miss that. Um, but I'm also really excited to watch my teammates um, win some natty champs next year.